This is part three of the 1100 subscriber special. And we're here to present to you our fourth teaser trailer of the 2020 edition of the walkthrough of the Dell Dimension 4600 running Windows XP Home Edition, starting right now. I think we're gonna start watching a Microsoft Money tutorial. We're gonna start off with the Manager Taxes tutorial. So let's just take a look at that and see what we think of it. It's gonna be a good tutorial and I'm gonna enjoy it a lot. So why not just watch it? So let's go. Gonna minimize this window too, so let's do that. Yeah, I don't know why it's being I don't I don't know why it's being slow. It's just because I just logged in immediately and I had to like go into my computer immediately as well. Because I also wanted to do that, so let's just get this going. So we'll come out just right. All I have to do is take this figure into my payroll department and have them adjust the withholding. If we prefer, we could set up a monthly bill to help us save more by April 15th, or update our budget to reflect an IRS refund. Our options for April 15th seem pretty straightforward. They are. With money, we'll be ready to use a tax program, file our taxes by hand, or turn our information over to an accountant. We can even file our taxes on the web. You're right, Amy. Money will definitely make it easier to get our taxes ready this year. Coming in the next part, we're going to learn how to create a budget. And that's, that's what's going to come after this, because we already talked about using the Lifetime Planner. So, in the next part, we will do create a budget. So be sure to stay tuned in the next part. And we need to make sure we have enough reserve for unexpected expenses that come up during the year. Sounds like we're talking about creating a budget. You know, we can use the budget planner in Microsoft Money. Right. It walks us through all the steps. This page gives us the rundown. Look, this says that Money can use information from categories and amounts we've already entered. Let's do that then. Pre-filling our budget will save us some work because Money will calculate budget estimates for us. Okay. But I'm curious, what if we didn't have any transactions? Or what if we wanted to ignore our transactions and set up a budget completely from scratch? Expenses. Anything special here? It's just what you think it is. Our monthly bills and expenses. May cooking. Our budgeted expenses can even account for our occasional spending. You mean like house repairs and car insurance? Let's take a look at some things on Windows Media Player. So, um, there are some things I've put onto the computer. And there's others that are like samples, of course. And I remember that I had, yeah, I have this whole thing on a thumb drive. You know, my Lexar one. I put the songs on this one, you know, Di Playhouse Disney, Imagine and Learn of Music. Yeah, I put that on a thumb drive, you didn't know. I mean, um, my old hard drive for the Dell laptop had this, um. But since we have a new hard drive, I'm not really sure if I'm going to need to, like, try to put this full album on the laptop again because I have a new hard drive. Seriously, I have a new hard drive for my Dell laptop because I know it just, yeah, I'm pretty sure. But, yeah, this computer, I mean, this Dell Dimension 4600, though, it's still the same. Like, it's not going to change or anything. And it's not, I mean... We're not going to get rid of any of this. We're not going to get rid of the sample stuff, okay? The sample music's awesome, and we love it a lot. All right, so... We got Drive By Truckers, Flatlanders, you know, with Julia, Imperial Teen Sugar, w One Moment by John D. Graham, and there's the Music Match part, and then there's Highway Blues by New Stories. I don't know what's up with the freaking artwork though, because I know I've seen this before whatsoever. But where was this? Where was this artwork from? Whoever had this, I, I'm pretty sure someone actually had this. Seattle Symphony Orchestra, and then uh, Secondhand Jive, Slobberbone, Vic Chestnut. And we're going to have to take a look at the pictures. Now, there are some pictures I put onto my computer, of course. 
and look at video because you see there are some videos that are on here especially this one which um this this one is uh i got this from the wayback machine because um by using youtube in the past like that um when i had to like back in 2018 when i took care of this i had to download this to my tablet then i had to get my tablet connected to this computer just then i could eventually like get this onto the computer so that's what i did I put on this, yeah, this is from the Clemmer. I mean, unfortunately, this video is, like, blocked worldwide for some reason, which sucks. But, I mean, I do love the Beatles and all, so I, I don't know why. It's just a good video to look at. And then... Um, take a look at the... Blaney wins this. Uh, Charlotte... 10, 13, or 6. The, this, and that. I think we can get that to play on, on quick play. We'll try that. Wait, I meant to say quick time. I'm very sorry. I don't know what is wrong with me. Let's just try to play this for a minute. I also remember putting this onto the Dell laptop just to eventually put it on for some nostalgic times. Just saying. Pretty cool, huh? The walkthrough. Windows XP on the Dell Dimension 4600 2020 edition. Coming on Friday, April 3rd, 2020. See you on that day. The fourth part of the 1100 subscriber special will be coming soon, so stay tuned.